DVD locations. Hi, I'm General Wes Clark, retired Army. I commanded an infantry company in Vietnam, and later I was NATO's Supreme Allied Commander Europe. TCM asked me to host this month's Friday Night Spotlight about the films of World War I. It's a subject I know something about. The First World War started on July 28, 1914. So this month marks the 100th anniversary of World War I. And for the next several hours, I'll introduce films that depict life during that war. First up is a powerful film, part war film, part courtroom drama. It's Paths of Glory from 1957, directed by Stanley Kubrick. The film is based on a novel written by a World War I veteran named Humphrey Cobb. His book is based on actual events, telling the story of a World War I French officer ordered to attack and move his troops forward against virtually impenetrable enemy defenses. When the attack fails, the officer's superiors randomly select three soldiers to be court-martialed for cowardice. Stanley Kubrick acquired the screen's rights to Cobb's book and began adapting the story into a screenplay. And like a typical gritty and realistic Kubrick film, he shot the film in black and white, and his use of long shots and the sharp and deep focus provided audiences with some of the most realistic combat footage ever shown in a motion picture. Have a look at the film, starring Kirk Douglas, Ralph Meeker, and Adolf Manjou, Paths of Glory. 